Blue skies means fun days. Helping skydivers with tips and techniques about safety, training and fun jumping from those who know. Welcome to Blue Skies Fun Days. It's funny how some things happen. I just put together a collection of pictures that I put out as scary pics too, and things happened. One was that an old friend and fellow skydiver offered me his collection of scary pics for next time. And the second thing was Melanie Curtis put out a video on her channel about the Dunning-Kruger effect. Details of Melanie's video are in the comments below. The Dunning-Kruger effect is a cognitive bias where people with limited knowledge or competence greatly overestimate their own knowledge or competence. And I started thinking about what makes some skydivers seem as though they are enthusiastically trying for a Darwin Award. The Darwin Awards recognise individuals who have supposedly contributed to human evolution by selecting themselves out of the gene pool or by dying or becoming sterilised via their own actions. And then I started wondering what else can cause people to get a bit cocky, a bit more confident than their experience would suggest. And I started to think about the internet and its plethora of information on just about any subject you want and how easy it is to watch from the comfort of your own lounge chair. As I pondered the subject of people possibly being a bit too cocky, I was reminded of a seminar series I ran a few decades back where I asked participants if I told them everything I knew about my then 20 years of skydiving, you know, all the intricate details uh, about every jump. Did they think they would be able to not only do a jump, but be able to act as a coach to novices as, uh, as I had done for a number of years? I was surprised and horrified at how many people said yes. They genuinely felt that they could strap on a rig, give other people advice and participate in a jump where they all successfully linked up in freefall. I then changed the basis of this seminar lesson to learning to swim and how regardless of how many books you read and how much practice you may have done lying on your bed as a kid, you know that when your father took his hand away from your belly, you would sink. The point is that when the subject was within their experience and comprehension, they could realistically relate to the subject. When it was so far outside their understanding in a three-dimensional world, and they've lived in a two-dimensional world, their mind allowed for them to falsely fantasize about their ability. What do these two people have in common? Two things at least. Firstly, they appeared in a video called Live to Die Another Day. And secondly, they probably thought they had it all under control prior to impact. I suppose in all that I'm saying here is that in our quest for fun and adventure, we often push our luck a little and sometimes a lot. And sometimes the result can be rather painful. Son, your ego is writing checks your body can't cash. Searching the web for Dunning-Kruger information, I came across a lot of similar charts that really did seem to represent a skydiver's evolution. My favourite was this one, where people rely on blind faith and that the adrenaline rush is worth it. This is generally followed by a big scare of some sort. And then, having descended into the valley of despair, the individual climbs the slope of enlightenment over many hundreds or thousands of jumps and reaches a plateau of sustainability. In essence, there is no easy way to become a confident skydiver or an expert in a particular discipline beyond learning from those who have gone before us and following their guidance. 
Maybe this quote from Harrison Ford is fairly appropriate. I got him! Great kid! Don't get cocky! <laughs> See you next time on Blue Skies Fun Days. Just a quick note to our skydiving family. Blue Skies Fun Days is here to help our family grow, have fun in the sky, and to do it safely. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, ring the bell, and tell your friends about the lessons we have on offer to help everyone become better skydivers. For more tips and techniques, click subscribe.